What is going on YouTube? Run Good Life coming back at you. Yet another video. We are busting more baseball on the channel. And today, definitely doing something a little bit different. We typically don't do these kind of high risk, high reward boxes. But 2020 Tops Inception Baseball is here. And uh, this product looks, I, I, I like the look of it. It kind of has that pop art, that noir, not noir, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Kind of like that pop art, kind of funky, uh, artsy kind of look to it. So $65 a box, $75 online. Um, I, I picked these up for $65. Seven cards per box. I believe you're going to get one auto or autographed relic per box. I'm going to go ahead, without further ado, go ahead and open these up. No, let's go ahead and hit all three of them really quick, and we will get those out of the out of the boxes because it's just going to be that one pack. Typically, a product that I do not bust. Um, I did some Crown Royal on the channel um, for basketball, and that's kind of a similar, although a bite a lot more expensive, I believe. What did I pay for those? That was like 175 or something like that. Something stupid. So, one card or one one pack per box. Seven cards per pack, so we'll go ahead and bust all three of these out of here. Um, no, saving on wrappers, uh, that's always a good thing, right? But uh, seven, only seven cards, so you're gonna get a lot of base cards, um, but you are guaranteed that one auto. There are some absolutely filthy patches. I just saw the Aristides Aquino black to one of one. And uh, that was absolutely filthy. It showed up on my Facebook timeline, not for sale, not for trade. And I was just like, man, I do have the Mitch Haniger from 2019, I believe. And uh, that's also a filthy patch as well. Um, so seven cards per short break right here. Uh, let's go ahead. Let's just go ahead and get into one of these and I will talk about it a little bit. I do like the price point. A lot more attractive. You know, about $10 a card or so. Um, so that is a lot more attractive to... Then $180 for eight cards, which was what I paid for Crown Royal. So these are going to be a thicker stock card. So I do not have any. Uh, I do not have any supplies for them. So if we hit something, I'm gonna have to put it in one of these jewel boxes. Um, so let's go ahead, Chris Bryant, and I'll I'll peel one off the top and show you guys. Good rookie, good rookie. It's only a hundred card set, I believe. Kind of just a really kind of thick stock. Has a really high end feel to it. Uh, like I said, the it's kind of that pop art style background, if you will. Um, so, I'm gonna start it off with a Chris Bryant, followed by a Bo Bichette rookie card. Again, a hundred hundred cards in the the set, so there are gonna be just a lot of top tier names, not a whole lot of junk. So, next card is gonna be J T Realmuto. That is gonna be. JT Real Mudo, not numbered. I believe we have our our hit right there. Let's go ahead. How are we gonna do this? Let's do it like that. Josh Stoutman, 16 and 99. That's gonna be a pink. Jose Ramirez Green, non-numbered. Saw that one already. The Shane Bieber. And so we have a we have a patch auto, and I'm feeling I'm running my finger along the back, and this is a sick patch. It's definitely two or three colors, so let's go ahead. Ah, Roger. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I thought we hit Jordan. Uh, Rogelio Armenteros, 27 of 75, but I thought we hit Jordan, and uh turns out did not quite get so lucky. Nice-looking card, but... Again, I told you guys I was running my finger and I could feel the stitching. So, imagine if that was Jordan. So, go ahead and set that right there and we will get into number two. There are also some crazy like booklets and things like that. So, I actually, um, I, the Mitch Haniger has a booklet in 2019 as well. And I just couldn't strike a deal with the gentleman who hit one of those. It was number two. It had a big Mariner's crest in it. But, unfortunately... It was gouging a little bit too deep um, for, a, for a player collector. And I just could not bring myself to pay that amount. So that one's still out there for me. So first card is going to be Christian Yelich. Again, I love the look of these cards. 
We have a Jordan Yamato rookie card. We have a Sean Murphy rookie card. I believe we have our hit right there. So it looks like it's probably going to be a just a straight auto. I didn't feel anything, which is fun to, to kind of feel your hit on the back and see what it may be. Chris Paddock, number 23 of 50. Nolan Arenado Green. And our <laughs> Shohei Otani. And going to be Michael Chavez, number 72 of 99. Beautiful looking card. That black background with that silver signature. Just a beautiful looking card. I love the fadeaway kind of of his stance right there. Kind of that pop art color. So really, really good looking card on that Chavis. So let's go ahead and get into the final one. Again, this is going to be a quick break, but I do have three more of these. So we are going to do two videos of Inception. Um, just wanted to kind of do a quick little video for you guys. I don't know if I'm going to be watching more of this product. We shall see after this, but I did want to do some Inception this year. Typically a product that I avoid, but uh, wanted to bring you guys some content. Wanted to show you guys a cool product, and I really like the look of these cards this year. So Travis Demerit, rookie card. Alex Bregman, rookie, or Alex Bregman, not a rookie card. Alex Bregman, a cheater card. Domingo Leba. Then we get into Michael Baez. Going to be a non-numbered green. Travis Demerit again. That's going to be a non-numbered green. Josh Stallman, <laughs> numbered 161 to 220. So that is not particularly the best hit. And of course, the Demerit and the Seth Brown. So let's go ahead and run through again. Here were some of our color. Let's go ahead and get all the non-number. That Beau Bichette was our rookie. So that one is definitely worth mentioning, that Beau Bichette. Good looking card. Just beautiful. So non-numbered greens of Ramirez, Demerit, and Baez, as well as Arenado. We had a Chris Paddock to 50. And a Josh Stamont to 99. There are three hits out of the three boxes. Josh Stamont to 220 on that one. And a Michael Chavez to 99. And our patch, which unfortunately hit the Astros, but we did not hit Yordan. But Rogelio Armanteros to 75 on the sticker auto there. So that's going to do it for the break. I want to know what you guys think of Inception. I do have another video coming out. We're going to do three more boxes of Inception. I like it. I'm a fan. I like the way the cards look. I really like this Bichette. Uh, I, like, I, just, I like the color in these cards. I like that they're thick. It feels like a premium product at not an incredibly premium price. And it's a high risk, high reward. So... Uh, that's going to do it for the break. If you guys enjoy my content, be sure to hit that like button, leave a comment, and hit that subscribe because we have a lot more baseball coming this season. Unfortunately, we don't have baseball on TV, but you guys can have some baseball breaks on YouTube uh, courtesy of me. So that's going to do it, and uh, stay safe out there as always, and uh, we will catch you on down the road.